Howdy folks, welcome to an anniversary video! Woo! Um, this, as you see, is Sonic, um, uh, yeah, I chose please. This is Sonic and the Black Knight, as you can clearly see. Um, I am, I have decided that for a special anniversary video, that I would, uh, try and do, uh, try and do a, a sort of anniversary video for a special friend of mine. His name, Fire Spirit. Don't exactly know if he has any numbers, but he, his name is Fire Spirit. Now, he wanted to see Sonic and the Black Knight, and by God, I'm showing him Sonic and the Black Knight. Now, um, the thing about this is, I'm not exactly sure whether or not I'm gonna do a Let's Play on this. Um, I'll, sh I'll tell you this for two reasons. One, I'm actually continuing a project, Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkai G2. And, um, and another reason, and, well, continuing on with that one, is basically because I, I just don't have enough. I'm, ow, I'm just playing starting. I'm, I have to. Uh, I'm continuing a project, DBZ BT2, and I want to continue that before finish that before I start any other project. As you see, I'm kind of sucking. You know what? This really isn't the mission I need to explain. But yeah, that's the first reason. The second reason? Well, the control scheme doesn't really work with my, well, work with my recording software. I'm using a camera and a tripod, and this game requires that I swing around like a maniac. Remember who you're talking to here. Just like this. I... I armed a town person. Dang it! Anyway, yeah, it basically requires that I swing around randomly. And that isn't really something I find works. The reason why I did, uh... Ah, the reason why I did the Dragon Ball Z games was because of their easy, easy control scheme. That's pretty much it. There's no easy way I'm gonna go about doing this. It's just not gonna happen. So, is this gonna turn into a full-fledged Let's Play? Probably not. You know? For a simple reason of it's just too hard to record. However, I am showing off the game because I think it's a fun game. And you all should try it. And plus it's an anniversary thing for Fire Spirit and of course I'm going to of course I'm going to try and do this. So I decided for this anniversary video to show off some of the levels that this game has to offer. Uh, this one is a ring gathering mission where you have to give rings to townsfolk, as you see by the number. You have to give... Dang it. You have to give, uh, 80 rings. Now, I've already gotten well, uh, past the limit. However... Cheese! Ow.
Yeah, in order to give the rings, you have to do a quick time event. Which, uh, I'll admit, stupid. But hey, it works. No problem. All right, I got some more followers and things like that. Eh, loyal page. I'm a loyal page. I got perfect guard. Let's identify it all. Alright, I got Morning Glory, Arthur's Legend, Thorn Anklet, Cursed Longsword, Rusty Helmet, and Spongy Bread. Sweet! I got a new book. Alright, I still have time, so let's uh, show off another uh, thing. Let's show off Rampage. Alright, now for this one, you basically go on a complete killing spree. With awesome music. See, I can pretty much wreck anyone in my path just by swinging like a maniac. Which I highly recommend doing. Because this game is just plain easy. Look, I'm swinging wildly, and I've already gotten half of the. I've already gotten to a uh, three fifths. I got hit by you. Now, one thing I mentioned, uh, haven't mentioned is the controls. Basically, you move around with the control stick in the direction. It's quite linear, I'll admit. And you guard here with uh, Z, which sometimes helps if you're uh, trying to... Yeah. If you're trying to do things like that. Now, these traps, I hate them. Simply because of that. Get him! Thank you. And you basically swing around with the Wii Remote. That's how you swing your sword. And to do this special thing, you have to press B. That basically brings up this thing, where you can basically completely kill anyone standing in your path. I'll demonstrate by massacring these set of soldiers who are just happen to be in my path. Nyer. Give. Give. That's what I kind of hate. And there we go. We got a present. And now we can end the level. Just made that should have been a five at least. Oh well. Or a four at least. Anyway, I still got some more. And we can identify all these. We got Cursed Longsword, Cursed Helmet, Rusty Helmet, Rusty Longsword, Broken Trap, Arthur's Legend, and Hero of Calm. Herb of Calm, my bad. Now, basically, that identification screen basically means that you can, uh, well, create special things. Now, let me show you a special challenge. One that I haven't done yet. Let's go with Rescue the Townspeople. Since I haven't done that yet. Now these special challenges are basically get to the goal or 
or do a specific move. And slash this, and you create a grind rail. That will pretty much wreck the wall. Who knew that thing was so powerful? No kidding. By the way, the sword I'm wielding right now is Caliber. A talking sword. Now, to jump, you pretty much press A. You can do a, a slashing attack. I don't know how I did that. Ow! I was slashing! Pretty much you can do your homing attack and... Watch that explode. Hey, and you pretty much just... And we're here already. Yeah, see, that was pretty easy. That was pretty much just get to the goal. And we get a Cursed Helmet and a Lollipop. When it quits, points are gained for defeating enemies without pause. That's great for if you're using a sword, uh, a special thingy. I don't exactly know myself. Now, uh, allow me to show you what bosses are like. I sort of showed you before, but I didn't show you naturally. These are basically the Knights of Arthur. Arthur has gone evil. If you want to know the story, look it up. This is Sir Lancelot. Basically, Shadow. Ow. Hey. Yeah, that's pretty much how you do things. But as you see, I pretty much wrecked him. I don't know why he gave me so much trouble before, but I wrecked him today. And proficiency level in night style increased. Now we can identify this as herb, bronze dagger, and spongy bread. Yo. Now that's pretty much what uh, Sonic and the Black Knight is all about. Now, um, am I ever gonna do a Let's Play on this? Probably not. Um, but, however, I may consider it if I can get my HD PBR working again. And when I finish DBZ BT2. However, until then, I'm gonna leave you off with this. Fire Spirit, thank you so much for a great five years, and I hope to have another five more. I'll see you then. Until next time, folks, have a great day.